Welcome back. All too often, the retired life can be a little dull for some people. John Fly caught up with Kyle and Jen Strickland, who spend their Ozarks life managing a unique business. On I-44 near Phillipsburg, there's a popular candy shop. They have everything. Oh, toxic waste worms. But for some real worms that eat waste, just travel three miles to the west, and you'll find Midwest worms. Oh, yeah, I've been thinking about getting my T-shirt that says, I've got worms. <laughs> Kyle Strickland has been growing composting worms since 2017. Okay. And people are intrigued. They say, well, what's that? What do you do with that? The idea crawled into Jen's mind when she was diagnosed with alpha-gal the tick-borne illness that makes people allergic to mammal meat and products. And once I found out I had the alpha gal, I knew I had to start raising my own food to be really clean for me. These are European night crawlers. And so she read something on how to produce the best garden, and the composting worm wiggled into the conversation. My first thoughts were, uh, it's another one of those creative ideas that my wife's come up with to keep me busy. But the more this retired firefighter read, the more he was intrigued. And so Kyle bought two thirds of a pound of red wigglers. Whenever she would cook, I would go in the kitchen and take like a, a piece of zucchini scrap or some food scraps and just put them in there for the worms to eat. And I just kept watching them and I was impressed with how fast they multiplied mm -hmm. and started to fill that container. And I thought, Man, somebody can make a business out of this. And that's how the Stricklands came to own Midwest Worms. The composting worms eat what would end up in a landfill. In the garden, they prevent chemicals from being sprayed and yield better fruits and vegetables. And the worms, uh, poop introduces a hormone to the soil. One of the things those hormones will do is they will create within the plant a natural resistance to pests and disease. And you might have guessed it, you can buy the worm castings or poop also from Midwest Worms. This is worm manure, mm -hmm. worm poop, mm -hmm. black gold. It's better for the environment, it's better for you, it's better for me, it's, it's just better. Mondays are the busiest days here at Midwest Worms as Jen and Kyle are shipping out nationwide and they're getting ready to head into a busy season. It varies between 70 and 100 pounds a week. Okay. That's a lot of worms to sift through by hand, weigh, and then mail out every week. On top of moving worms by age into different bins to keep them safe and healthy. We've, over the years, got a good system going. And these retirees are like kids again, playing up to 40 hours a week in the dirt. I'm Chad Pline with an Ozarks Life in Laclede County. Kyle says roughly 60% of their sales right now are for fishing worms. We have a link to Midwest Worms on our website. Just look for this story. And there also you'll find some links that Jen has created to help people living with alpha-gal.